tell you too. Well, I'm trying to make a quick video on parental control on your fire stick. As you see, this is the fire stick with Alexa. So this is your screen. As you see, this is your screen. Now, in order to get to your parental control, just in case kids buy stuff and stuff like that, you go to your settings. Okay, after your settings, you will go to preferences. Okay, and from there you have parental control. Okay, this will restrict access to videos, purchase, and certain type of content. So you click on it. So I'm gonna turn it on, right? So it's asking you for a password. So basically, is a five-digit password. And you can see one, two, three, four, zero. And then if you press the menu button, it will give you five, six, seven, eight, nine. So now you're gonna put a password. So for one, you know, you press up one, then it'd be two, three, four, zero. Okay, so now I'm gonna put a password. Okay, now it's gonna ask you to enter pin again as you can see so you do it again okay as you can see it's saving the pin and now it's enabled so basically you have enabled parental control the following default protection are now turned on pin protect purchases pin protect app launch Enable viewing restriction for content rated teen and above on Amazon. So this will basically have the list of stuff on buying purchases. You want to put them all on. It's up to you. If you want to um, look at the restrictions, you put it. Say as you can see, teen and mature. Basically, it's locked. These two are open family stuff in general. Okay, so that is how you put parental control on your fire stick. So now they will not be able to buy. So for example, Robert Hood, I'm gonna hit rent and it will ask you for a pin. Once you put your pin, then you can accept the payment. And it's pretty good for kids, so you won't have that mistake of them buying something you don't want them to buy. Well, that's it, YouTube. Like and subscribe, and thanks for watching, and more to come.